and welcome back to Let's Play Story of Seasons Pioneers of Olive Town. Alright, it's raining, so you know what that means. We're going to the mines. Well, actually, before we go to the mines, hold on a second. I'm going to clean up my inventory a bit more. You know what? Why am I keeping these in here? Also, why can't I take them out? Oh, that's why. I'm going to quickly put away a few things that I don't need. Actually, no, I guess I can keep that one with me, because we're going to be getting more gold today. So yeah, we're going to the mines here and getting myself a bunch of gold and silver. As much as I can get. Before we go, though, I'm just going to quickly throw these down for now. I'll actually move them around and organize them later. I just need them out of storage. Okay. Also, before we go, I'm going to run over to the store. Or not the store, the museum. Because I want to go donate a few fish. Oh, we also need to grab some grass seed, right? Because, uh... All of our grass kind of ran out, so we're going to need to plant some more. Although, honestly, at this point, we don't really need too much more fodder. We have plenty of fodder. Also, here. Have some grass rock Or grass? Glass rocks. I can talk, I swear. Okay. Yeah, let's go donate some treasure and some fish, and then we'll get going. Hello. Here's your squid. Is this the first squid we've donated? I could have sworn we donated one squid before, didn't we? Ah, I guess not. All right. Hello. And then I believe we can donate... Oh, we can donate both these treasures, apparently. I thought we had already donated one, but I guess not. Well, that goes here. Hello. And this goes, like, right here. Perfect. Alright, let's get it going. We have a lot of work to do. Oh, I didn't bring any, uh, what is it, juice for Laura. You know what? I want to see if she likes tea. I have plenty of tea. Would you care for some tea on a nice, rainy, cold mm -hmm. day like this? Mm -hmm. She's fine with it. Also, yeah, Summer Jamboree is like three days away. That's going to be exciting. Okay, so I want grass. Well, fodder, same thing. So what do we have? We have like three, six, nine, twelve. We need twelve. Perfect. And yeah, I'm still saving my money to get myself my tools and my house upgraded. Speaking of a house upgrade, I want to check one thing real quick. Never mind, I want to see what my materials I needed for, but I guess we'll check tomorrow. Alright, let's get to the mines. I want to spend as much time down there as possible to get more gold. Like I said, right now, main goal, get myself that golden hammer. Oh, wait, do I have fodder on me? Oh, hold on a minute. You know what? Hold on. I'm going to do one thing. I need chest. Uh... What kind of chest do I want? I guess a wooden one. Hold on, let me grab some logs. I'm just going to make a chest over here for all the animal stuff that we need. So we don't have to keep running all the way back. Like, give me a second. Oh, it's the lumber, not uh, logs. Whoops. There. Oh, do I have any dye I can use on this? Like, we could paint a nice blue color. Okay. And then while I'm here, let me grab all the animal stuff I don't need. Or I'm gonna need. So I need these, these, these. That's about it.
Uh, what else? You know what, I'm gonna, no, not thread. I wanna grab all my animal products as well. So like, I'm gonna grab my yarn, my cloth days here because that's not animal products surprisingly in this game. Uh, are there any other animal products? I guess I can take my bait with me too. That's kind of like animal products. Okay. But yeah, like I said, I want to get things organized, so let's get a box over here with just our animal products. I guess I'll put it here for now. I'll probably move it later. Alright, so let's put this in there. I could have sworn I had more yarn, didn't I? And yeah, I guess I'll consider fish bait animal products for now. Let's get our milk. Every single time that eat, like, prompt comes up, I think it wants me to eat the animals. But no, it's just saying because I'm carrying something I can eat. It does not literally mean take a bite out of your cow. Also, yeah, I also want to get my, like, animal... Or what? I almost got an animal pen. I want to get my barn and my chicken coop upgrade at some point. Right now, they're still kind of on the small side. It might not be a bad idea to get the chicken coop upgrade so we can breed more chickens. Also, we still what kind of animals are we still missing? We're still missing rabbits and goats, right? Yeah. Yeah, I need to like double check when we can actually get those. I don't remember off the top of my head. Oh, right, I also wanted to do this. It's blue now. I have the perfect number of makers for these. Perfect. Okay, so I think we're good. Animals have been taken care of, pet, harvested, all that stuff. Grass has been planted. I think it's time to head to the mines. Let's go. Oh, right, before we go in, though, let's uh, make sure we get what gold we can get right now. Also, how far am I away from level 7 mining? Not too far away. Okay. Once we get level 7 mining, that's actually going to make things better, because that gives us an extra, like, piece of ore per mining thing. So that does add up really, really quickly. I also want to get to level 9. That's when we unlock, like, the good mining area as well. Although, good mining area is relative. Because, honestly, this mine is still probably the best way to get, like, a lot of the really high-end uh, ores. In fact, I'm pretty sure this is the only place where we can get ore calcum no matter what. Well, other than, like, maybe buying it at the Earth Sprite Village. Which, honestly... That might be a good thing to, like, dedicate a bunch of, uh, sprite points towards. Only problem is I don't remember if he ever sells Ori Calcum. We'll see. Either way, I'm not gonna worry about that until I get Golden Hammer no matter what, because obviously even if we found it, we couldn't really harvest it that efficiently. Anyways, I want to make sure I get plenty of silver, too, to make, like, silver... Not silver, uh... No, yeah, silver. Make myself more sprinklers. Oh, that's a raw diamond. That is going straight... Oh, wait, my jewel maker is busy right now. Okay, that's going to go in the jewel maker once it's available. Oop, gold. I need to move. Oh, that didn't hit me. I also kind of want to get rid of these moles whenever I can. Yeah, right now, like I said, our hammer is weak, so we don't do too much damage. 
Don't worry, though. Once we get Golden Ori Calcum, we're going to turn everything against them. That's another reason I kind of want to go deeper without Golden Hammer. Uh, things in the lower level kind of have a lot of health. I'm still not sure what the point of having enemies in this game was. This is kind of a weird inclusion. The only other game that did that was like, well, all the Rune Factory games, obviously. But the only other real, like, main series game that did that was DS, I think. Because I can't remember if any of the other, like, entries in the series had enemies in the mine that could hurt you. Uh, before we go down, though. Let me take a quick look around and make sure there's no more gold on this floor. Ow! That actually hit me. Now there's silver, though. Might as well grab it. Not like it takes a ton of energy. Also, speaking of energy, I'm gonna have myself a nice little thing of tea. Wow, tea sucks. In terms of stamina re regen. It's fine as a drink. I'm not a huge tea drinker. Although, recently I have been drinking more tea, mostly because I got sick, but, eh, in general, it's not a terrible thing to drink every once in a while. Okay, uh... Oh, gold, perfect. I was looking for that. So let me see, what are... How much gold do we have so far? Also, why am I charging up for this one thing? We have 20 things of gold, so that's what, four ingots? We have like two ingots in storage, I think. And I need 10 to upgrade my hammer. Okay. I guess I'll just keep going till I run out of food or stamina, whichever comes first. Probably st oh, actually no, I guess they're the same thing. Honestly, at this point, time is going to be the main issue that's going to kick us out uh, sooner rather than later. I kind of miss the days where going in the mines made time freeze. So you can literally spend days in there, but in like outside time, you've only been gone for like 10 minutes. I'm still not sure what I think about like games that freeze time while indoors and games that don't. Honestly, that's just kind of a relative thing you kind of have to get used to. I will say, though, I do have a lot of nostalgia for the games that froze time indoors. Although, in terms of time management and challenge, I, it makes sense why they make time just continuously flow no matter what. As convenient as it was to be in the mines, like I said, for several days with only 10 minutes passing in the real world, obviously in terms of realism, that makes absolutely no sense. Why, like, all the buildings in town are a weird indoor purgatory where time doesn't pass. Oh well. Also, yeah, I'm still keeping an eye out for pitfalls. Because, like I said in this game, uh, pitfalls are absurdly dangerous in that they can drop you super far down and knock you out immediately. They're really good if you want to get deeper down to get to the Ori Calcum levels, but right now, like I said, we're not too worried about that. Oh, oh, that's what I'm looking for. We just got mining material gain increased to two. Ooh, okay. Now that we're level seven mining, we should get, like, what, three per? Four per. Perfect. Yeah, four per. Okay, that's going to speed things up a whole lot. I'm not falling down that pitfall. I learned from last time. Not until I have more stamina. Or food. Also, that's kind of another reason I want to get super deep down the mines. That's another, like, free stamina increase once we get to a certain level. I don't remember what the level is, though. Also, I'm pretty sure it's this mine, not the second. Wait, did we ever get down to the bottom of the second mine? I just realized. Because I can't remember if the stamina upgrades at the bottom of this mine or the second mine. It might be on the second mine. Uh, I think I'm going to have to go double check that later. Ooh, 
there's a lot of gold on this floor. Hold on, I'm gonna eat some pudding, get myself more stamina. Oh god, oh god. I, okay, you know what, hold on a minute. I need to start fighting back. I'm in a very risky position right now. Soup, give me some soup. Wow, soup doesn't restore too much. Okay, I think I'm gonna grab these rocks and then get out of here. I am definitely running the risk of getting knocked out by these moles. Okay, you know what? I think it's time to leave. One more floor. Perfect. I'm gonna grab this and then get out of here. Cause yeah, I just realized, did I ever reach the bottom of the second mine? I could have sworn I did, but maybe not. Okay. Well, anyways, we just made a buttload of gold. So, um, I'm gonna run to the makers. What do we need for another jewel maker? It might be worth investing in a second one of those. Also, maybe some stone lanterns around just to make things look nice, but um, where is it? Oh, this requires raw diamond? Or no, raw white opal. Uh, maybe. It might be worth investing in a second one of those because of how long they take. Still not empty, still not empty. Almost, probably another day. Probably doesn't help that it's been raining every day too. Okay, let's uh, get to the makers and start sticking some stuff in. Do I have any raw white opals? I think I converted them all, unfortunately. We might have to, oh wait, give me that. We might have to start thinking about going back to the mines. Or some of the earlier mines to get that. Okay. Let's uh, get all this stuff converted. What can I take out of this? Not much. You know, I'm also gonna, like, get all my seeds organized, too. Oh yeah, I think this is gonna be my raw materials chest. In fact, you know what? Yeah, hold on a minute. What kind of chest do I want my seeds to be in? What says, like, seeds? Probably more wood. Or mortar, that could work. Do I have any mortar? No. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna make another wooden chest. We'll make a wooden chest and, like, color it. What says, like, seeds? Green? Green. Oh. In fact, I'm gonna put all my, like, spare crops in this one. Okay, uh, let's put it, like, down here, then. Oh, inventory's full, right? Um, actually, one minute. I can fix that. Okay. So yeah, let's stick that like right here. No, come on. Stop locking onto the right. We'll paint this one green. And this is gonna be basically where all my crops, all my spare crops and seeds go into. I really did buy a lot of extra seeds when I didn't really need to, oh well. Okay, so what else can I take out of here? Oh, I have a lot of rice seedlings I never shipped. Whoops. 
Or I never planted. Are these even good still? Do we start grass seedlings? Oh yeah, I could plant these. You know what? Hold on a minute. How many do I have? Nine? Wait a second. I can definitely use these then. I have been wanting to expand the field a bit more. I need a bucket. Okay. Also, I never really did upgrade my hoe yet, have I? I should probably do that next. Like I said, the hoe tends to be the last thing I upgrade. It's kind of the one thing you use once a season, that's about it. Okay, let's get these in the ground then. I have one more I can just stick in a hole somewhere. Uh, or I could just sell it or keep it for now. I'll just keep it for now. Okay, perfect. So that box is now for seeds and crops. I might move it later, but for now, that's just going to stay there. Okay. I think we're good for now. Let's uh, head to bed. Is there anything I need to sell? I'm going to go put the yarn in the other box because I want to keep those to like, make clothing out of. But yes, yeah, slowly but surely we're getting things more organized. I'll clear out the rocks and stumps and all that stuff later. It's late. It's time for bed. We got a lot done today, so tomorrow or the day after, we'll have enough gold to, like, get our tools upgraded finally. It's raining today, raining tomorrow, and a typhoon on Friday the 13th. Great. We should go fishing on a typhoon day. We should just go fishing or something. You know what? I'm going fishing tomorrow. We've done enough mining for a while. I want to get my fishing seal upgraded. Oh, I also got to want to get my fishing rod upgraded too. In fact, hold on a minute. Is my fishing rod still silver? Or it's still iron? It's still iron. I need to get this upgraded. Okay, you know what? I have the, I have the uh, silver to do that. We're doing that today. I also think I need wood. Got all my makers are done right now. Okay, let's grab what we need. And let's just take stock of what we have so far. So, let's grab this. I think it's solid lumber we need to upgrade the fishing rod. Oh, uh, we got more seeds we can plant, so let's get those planted. I guess it's all going to go down here at this point. The field is a giant mess of mix and match, uh, like... Crops, that's fine. Alright, let's grab these. Grab my onions. Grab my six star potatoes. Oh, so we have potatoes. Did I get any more potato seeds yet? I did. Still only level six, right. Oh, yeah, dumb. My level six, the stuff, the level six, like, seeds I planted haven't come in yet. Also, we do have a spore maker now. So we can get higher level mushrooms soon, too. Which, honestly, aren't as important to me, but... Hey, level, higher level mushrooms are higher level mushrooms. I don't know, I've never really dedicated too much on mushrooms. I feel like that's kind of a side thing. I'm gonna stick one more potato in there. The rest, though, we're selling. Okay. So, gold. How much gold do I need? I almost almost have enough gold as well. I'm going to take this with me as well, just in case. Okay. But yeah, it is rainy today, but for once, we are not going to the mines. Instead, today, we're going to go fishing. I'm going to do a lot of fishing. Well, I'm going to get... Did that fill right back in?
All right. Oh yeah, I do need to also save up my silver to fix up the silo as well, but I feel like the final tool upgrades come first. Oh, also, did we just get... Oh, we just got uh, Milk Plus. Okay, my cow absolutely loves me. Oh, also, I did upgrade my... Or get a higher level. Do I have a cheese maker yet? I do. I need lumber. Give me a second. Yeah, as... As much as, like, the game encourages you to have separate boxes for everything, I really wish this was one of those games where all the boxes were interconnected and you just have, like, a giant storage bin. Honestly, I kind of prefer that system over, like, a lot of the other, like, this individual box system. Cheese. I can make cheese now. That used my iron, didn't it? Yeah, or, that my, or my silver, didn't it? Oh, no, I still have some silver left. Okay. Let's get these makers down. Guess I'll put the maker here. That is going to be the, my milk plus. So we're going to make cheese. Oh, how long is that going to take? Two hours. Okay. Oh, we're going to make cheese. We're going to make some butter. Oh, actually, no. Now we can actually tell which one's higher value, butter or yogurt. All right, no, wow, my makers are actually working out perfectly, huh? Okay. All right, I think that's all the farm work done. Let's head to town for a bit. Oh, no, actually, before we go to town, is it ready yet? Come on. Uh, I'm still waiting for those last two things of gold. Okay, you know what? I don't know if we're going to be able to get the gold upgrade today, but... Oh, wait. I keep forgetting, what day is the carp not the carpenter, the, uh, what day is the tool shop closed? It might be closed today. Tuesdays, no, never mind, they're always closed on Tuesdays. Hey. Give me that silver fishing rod. Alright, it's so what, ten? Yeah, we need two more. Alright. It's also going to cost a lot of my money, but that's okay. Now that we have a higher level crop, we should be able to make that back relatively quickly. Hello. How much is it going to cost me to upgrade the barn, by the way? Okay, uh, it's going to require gold, but that's fine. I keep hitting the wrong thing. Expand house. I have the money, I just need the silver and the iron. And by that, I mean I need the silver. Okay. Also, I keep forgetting to put away my yarn. Also, yeah, we can get chicken breeding kits now. Unfortunately, we need a bigger, um, what is it? We need a bigger bar, or chicken coop in this case. So, we really should start looking to upgrades for those. Also, I still can't... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. No, I can't buy a mountain yet because I don't have a stable. Okay. Yeah, I really need to get that stable fixed up. Alright, is there anything else I wanted to grab while I'm in town? I don't think so. Where's Laura? I didn't make her any fruit or vegetable juice today because... Actually, wait. I can do that really quickly. One minute. Let me see your kitchen, people. I need to cook something for my girlfriend. Potato juice. Here we go. Gotta love a nice potato water. It's green. Which is kind of worrying, because that should not be green. Anything made out of potatoes, like... Completely out of potato should not be that shade of green. Mm -hmm. Alright. But with that, I think we're going to wrap things up here then. 
So, next time on Let's Play Story of Seasons Pioneers of Omtown, I'm gonna go fishing for an episode. So, till then. <laughs>